I want to show you this video we got. Now, this is from Robert Petty in Waxahachie. We'll take a look here. Let's let it cycle one more time. You'll see power flashes oh, in goodness. the distance. Yeah. There it is, and then the lights go out. This same power pole, there it is, the power oh, line yeah. down in Waxahachie. So that caused quite a few power outages there in Waxahachie. This video was taken uh, from Northtown Village Apartments in Waxahachie. So power out there. We've seen up to, ba uh, up to baseball size hail reports across North Texas tonight. That was in uh, Navarro County. Now tonight, the severe thunderstorm watch has been canceled for western portions of North Texas. It's still ongoing for the Dallas Fort Worth area off to the east and the south as well. Same risks up to tennis ball size hail and 60 mile per hour winds. Some good news right now, at least at this very moment, there are no severe thunderstorm warnings in effect in our area currently. That could change within the next few minutes. These, uh, these storms have been pulsing up in intensity. Very heavy rain and a ton of lightning been falling here in Dallas. Downtown seeing very heavy rain. I'm going to watch this right here near Loop 12. Uh, so you see Northwest Highway, some Maybe a little bit of hail trying to form here uh, east of Park Cities. There's 76 degrees in Dallas now. See if we'll get lucky enough to get a little lightning. There it is. We'll take it. It's been quite a show watching the tower camps tonight. There's the very heavy rain in Dallas County. More thunderstorms kind of up and down here uh, in Hunt County and eastern Collin County. This was severe thunderstorm more moments ago in Ellis County. It is now expired as it moves toward Corsicana, but still some P to penny or dime size hail as possible. Severe thunderstorm warnings in East Texas. Overall, the coverage still is scattered in nature. It'll start winding down later tonight. More thunderstorms, though, as we go through the overnight. We're not completely done, but the severe weather threat has lessened for now. A little bit of rain for the morning commute. We'll talk to, we have to, about the record heat we saw today. There's a lot to talk about, and it's all coming up. See you again in just a few minutes, Jesse. Thank you. Well, our WFAA app will definitely help you stay aware overnight. You can also sign up to get weather alerts there and watch our radars. Just search WFAA in your app store, and it is free to download.